Hi, it's Diane. I wanted to show you a wedding book that I made, a smash book. Someone requested one to um, <clears throat> purchase to give as a gift. Um, it took me a long time to make, longer than a smash book normally takes because I didn't have any wedding themed paper and the only wedding themed um, accessory type things that I had was one sheet of stickers that I had purchased on clearance. So I had to make a lot of things with my Cricut. I didn't want to go out and buy things for it because I have so much other things, so many other things. So the Cricut cartridges that I used, I'm just going to tell you what cartridges I used and I won't identify them as I go through the book. I used Art Nouveau, Storybook, Classic Font, Cindy Lou, Damask Decor, Sophisticated, Tags, Bags, Boxes, and more. I think I got them all. So here's the cover. It's made with an old book cover and bound with a bind it all. And this um, background piece I actually used with, I cut it out with my Big Shot. Everything else was cut with the Cricut. So I have um, entwined rings with a little ribbon through them cut out of a silvery paper that I had. This is part of the sticker sheet. It just says Mr. and Mrs. And then there's a recollections flower with some pearls and sequins on it. Inside, um, there's another one of the stickers. It just says happily ever after. And then once upon a time, a good fairy tale start to a wedding. And then the stickers up there spell out love. Another sticker says dream. This page, I <clears throat> um, titled it The Dress, and I had a couple of little pieces left from um, Graphic 45's one, um, I forgot the name of it, and I knew the name of it before I started this video, but the, the one that has had pages for each month of the year. So there's a bride getting ready, and then that is a journaling card that says bride. And then this page I labeled, titled The Tux, and I had a sticker there of a top hat. And then I decorated these plain white pages with washi tape borders, and then I made these pretty frames. I'm going to include the cutouts that the Cricut cut out from these so that the recipient can use those cutouts as a template for cutting out pictures to put in there. I had these little metal tabs that someone had given to me. I think they were a set of Valentine tabs and I believe they were We Are Memory Keepers, I think. But this one says true and this one says love. So I had just cut this page in half so it's a little bit shorter. The book is about about 8 by 10 so these 6 inch pages were a little short but I put these tabs on. And then this page is decorated with a strip from the sticker sheet and then these banners from the sticker sheet. Love, Laugh, and Wish, and then another sticker here. I glued a journaling card here. I have a library pocket here. And I put a journaling card in here with another one of those little metal tabs. It has a heart on it and it says File, file under L for Love. And these are from the sticker sheet butterflies and the bird. Here's a sticker that says Our Wedding Day. And another sticker and then I have a stamp from Little Yellow Bicycle. It says a day to remember and then they can circle the month and the day and write in the year. These pages I made photo mats um, with my Cricut and I glued on this little journaling tag and I put a sticker with sequins in the middle of that flower. These flowers are printed on the paper. This sticker says, with this ring I thee wed. And I made this little pocket with the Cricut. Well, I turned the heart into a pocket. And there's a tag-shaped sticker, so I put it onto this little shipping tag that I had. A couple more photo mats, a journaling spot. There's a library pocket, and I cut out um, I love you and glued it to the top of that. And then this tag I stamped with an old Stampin' Up set from 1997. 
And there's a bride and groom and a pair of doves. I used a Tim Holtz reinforcement circle on that. Um, I will identify these because I love it. I have an Art Nouveau um, Cricut cartridge and I just love the way these turned out. They were a lot of work, but Mr. and Mrs. And then I have this masculine looking tag and a feminine looking tag. This is um, Damask Decor and I believe that's from Picturesque. There's a sticker with the cake with a few more sequins on it. A couple of photo mats I put on here and then cut out Always and Forever. And then for this, these two little short pages, this, these two pages took a lot of time. I made a library card, a library pocket and put on some Recollections bling and then cut this out. Had three cuts to make with the frame and the back and the little decorative addition and then I stamped 10 things I love about you I cut these out with the tags bags and more <clears throat> cartridge which I love and I don't think you can get it anymore but I cut these long tags out and then stamped numbers on them from 1 to 10 so I made this one in blue so the bride can write what she loves about her husband and then I cut I did this one in pink same thing so the groom can write what he loves about his wife and these pages are from life documented and I didn't want to lose any of the words, so I, I, I had to cut off the bottom, but then I cut the pages in half and made them short pages. And then the last few pages I used um, to be anniversary pages. So this one, I believe this is from Art Deca or Art Nouveau, <clears throat> those, the number and the letters. And then this is from the calendar. I forgot the name of it, but the calendar cartridge that I have. So it says first anniversary, and then this pa paper came like this. It says I love you at the top. This is second anniversary, and I made a pocket here and made these pretty little tags with my damask decor cartridge. And then this says third anniversary. I had this little square pocket, so I, I keep bumping the camera here. I made this cute little tag with my Cricut and stamped on the back journaling lines. Fourth anniversary, fifth anniversary, and the last page um, I just stamped All You Need Is Love and I stamped all of these. these. All these stamps are a set from Little Yellow Bicycle and then there's from the Once Upon a Time um, paper stack and happily ever after and I put in an envelope I decorated it with some of the scraps of paper and some washi tape and then included some extra goodies they can use in the book so there is the wedding book smash book that someone requested and I hope that they enjoy it and I hope you enjoyed watching the video I'll be back with another video soon have a great day bye